Greetings and welcome to the Haiku Pond, a place to ponder life through haiku. My name is Anthony, and I'm the caretaker of the pond. During this visit, we will revisit the theme of gratitude and feature haiku submitted by other poets. To prepare, let's take a deep breath and dive into the pond. From Carly Whitworth on Instagram. I thank the darkness. Without it, I could not see the light inside me. From Monster Poems on Twitter. You bring endless joy and brighten my soul with love. Forever thankful. From Haiku Tech on Twitter. Lighter skies, the sparrows join up, most of my dots. From Carissa Hoyman on Twitter. Focusing anew, aware you will overcome, thankful for your strength. From Melody Wong on Twitter. Grains of sand and truth ingrained in faraway shells. Minuscule splendor. I said in part one of gratitude that I have a long list of things I'm grateful for. I think the haiku from these featured poets help illustrate some of the items on that list. The world can be a pretty terrifying place at times, and it can be challenging to find joy. But I think if we follow the lead of these haiku, we can begin to find those diamonds in the rough, those little sparks of joy that highlight our lives. Speaking of gratitude... I'm very grateful to the featured poets in this episode for their submissions and permission to share their haiku. I'm humbled and honored by the trust you've placed in me, and I appreciate you contributing to the pond. If you want to connect with these poets or reread their haiku, you can find both in the description of this episode. Give them a follow to see more of their wonderful work. And if any of these haiku or the questions to ponder from part one inspired you and you want to share, please feel free to reach out. I want this to be a community space where everyone can share. You can leave a voicemail via anchor.fm slash the haiku pond, send an email to the haiku pond at gmail.com, or find the podcast on Twitter at the haiku pond. I, and I'm sure the listeners, would love to hear what inspiration you've taken to be more grateful. As a reminder, here are the questions from part one of Gratitude. What are the big and small things you're grateful for? How can you express that gratitude? That concludes this week's episodes on Gratitude. Next week, we'll explore love and loss. Episodes are released every Monday and Wednesday. Thanks for listening, and keep writing haiku. Thanks for visiting the Haiku Pond. If you've been inspired by what you've heard, please share the show with a friend. For more haiku, you can follow me on Instagram, at Haiku by Fifi. And for podcast updates, follow the pod on Twitter, at the Haiku Pond. For more episodes, visit anchor.fm slash thehaikupond.